So, whose leg do you have to hump to get a dry martini around here? <laughs> hmm. God, look at the size of these steak knives. What, what are they serving us, Tyrannosaurus Rex? Not likely. Hey, what if I just drank this whole bottle of ketchup? <laughs> you do imagine? You dare me? Kind of ruins it for the next person who might want some ketchup. So how's the flying business? Not so great. The economy's sort of taking its toll. A lot of salary cuts, a lot of layoffs. Yeah? That's pretty much it. I mean, you want to learn more, read the papers, go on the internet. I, I don't know. Boy, that's got to be an interesting job. I bet you guys... How do those things work? What, planes? How does a plane work? Yeah. You want me to sit here and explain to you how a plane works? I don't know. Yeah. Okay, I'll tell you. Brian. In a craft and strain and level flight is acted upon by whistle at gravity, thrust, and drag. The opposing forces balance each other, lift equals gravity, and thrust equals drag. The thrust, the force that moves an airplane forward through the air, thrust is created by a propeller or a jet in yen. And you have drag, air resistance that tends to slow the forward movement of an airplane. You also have gravity, the force that pulls all objects towards the earth. And last but not least, the lift, the upward force that is created by the movement of air above and below a wing. Air flows faster above the wing and slower below the wing, creating a difference in pressure that tends to keep an airplane flying. <sighs> I'll see you, Brian. Thanks for the f steak.